Shalom, shal <clears throat> excuse me, Shalaki. Shalom, Shalom to the nation of Israel. <laughs> Before I get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai by Hashem Rakat Badash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike into a speckled bird. Tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom, right? So this your brother Shopper. Hey, you see it. Brooklyn Bishop Lamar Whitehead sentenced to nine years in prison for wire fraud, extortion, and lying to the feds. Once you lie to the FBI, man, <laughs> that's automatic, like five years, I think five years sentence, lying, just lying to the feds alone to get your ass in trouble. You lie to them, that's, <laughs> that's some other shit. But, hey, man, hey, it's beautiful to see. It's beautiful to see. It's beautiful. Oh, you praying? No, no, I ain't pray for nothing. All, all you wicked ass pastors gonna get it. All y'all wicked ass pastors gonna get it. Man, look at, look at, look at these pictures, man. Look at these pictures. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's get a scripture real quick before we even read some of that. Let's get a scripture. <laughs> Yep, this is the first thing when I say that. This is the first scripture came to my mind. Like Elder Apostle told, what what scripture, what precept comes to mind when you when you see this? What's what's the first one? This right here. Jeremiah 23 and 1. A woe be unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pasture, saith the Lord. Therefore, thus saith the Lord, power of Israel against the pastors that feed my people. Ye have scattered my flock. And driven them away and have not visited them. Behold, I will visit upon you the evil of your doing, saith the Lord. Yep, I will visit upon you the evil of your doing, saith the Lord. So everything is on the Lord. The Lord in control of everything. So I, I ain't do nothing, man. We come out, we bring these scriptures out. We tell y'all, y'all got to chill out. Y'all going off. Y'all passes going off. Matter of fact, let's get that one. It's in the scriptures. We spoiled them. We spoiled them. Mark them that caused the vision. But this one came. This is the one I thought about. Ezekiel 13 and 2. Son of man, prophesy against the prophets of Israel that prophesy and say thou unto them, that prophesy out of their own hearts, hear the word of the Lord. Thus saith the Lord, woe unto the foolish prophets that follow their own spirit and have seen nothing. O Israel, thy prophets are like the foxes in the desert. <laughs> eh, damn, damn, damn fox, man. Chewing on the people, chewing on the people, man. Let's get, let's pick one of these articles. Where are we going to go? Yeah, I seen these pictures. I was like, yep, good for his ass. Old fly Gucci suit wearing ass ninja. Yeah, you got to be easy, man. Like I said, you two be on us now. Bling, 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 Bishop Lamar Whitehead clad in jail garb as he learns his fate for stealing New York City woman's retirement fund. He stole a woman's retirement fund. Like, come on, man. The only ice he, he's wearing now is handcuffs. Bling, bling, Bishop. Bling, bling, Bishop. Lamar Whitehead, the famously flashy Brooklyn pastor who once bragged that Mayor Eric Adams mentored him, was sentenced <laughs> to nine years in prison Monday after the jury found him guilty of stealing a parishioner's mother's retirement fund and other crimes. The convicted fraudster, known for wearing designer suits, gaud, gaud, gaudy, gaudy um, jewelry, and driving a Rolls Royce, sported muted tan jail garb in Manhattan. Yeah, brought you down. The Lord brought, look, this, this, this man, I ain't even going to... I don't even want to make this long. It's, this dude is a clown, man. This guy up there. Look like the fucking Riddler in um, Batman. 
Whitehead, 45, was convicted in March of scamming Pauline Anderson, a 58-year-old nurse and a mother of one of his flock at Canarsie leadership of Tomorrow's International Ministries out of 90000 she'd given him to invest in a house he claimed he would buy for her and fix up. Why didn't she just buy the house herself? I guess she figured he going to hook up, get a deal or whatever. Instead, the flamboyant pastor who became known as the as the bling bishop blew the cash on personal expenses, including purchases at Louis Vuitton and on BMW car payments, pro prosecutors say. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm glad. It's, it's, it's a fucking demon, man. Yeah, you going to steal 90000 from a woman. Whitehead was also convicted of attempting attempted extortion by touting his alleged ties to the mayor to get an auto body shop owner to lend him five wow five hundred thousand in return for official favors from the mayor. <laughs> and he was found guilty of lying to a bank to get a two hundred fifty thousand dollar loan and of fibbing 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 to the FBI agents. When they raided his New Jersey mansion. Whitehead knew at the time that he could not actually obtain the favors that he promised. Prosecutors said Adams has not been accused of wrongdoings in the case. Yeah, I wonder if he got that 500, did he bust? Yeah, look at that. Uh, look at that. That right there. That's <laughs> That should be the thumbnail. Look at that. That ain't no godly man right there. That dude look like he, he, he won't rob you. He, he ran into him. <laughs> he ran into him. <laughs> you run into him in the alley, man. <laughs> you know, you know he up to no good. <laughs> man, yeah, man. Let me get another scripture, man. Let me get another. They, they just greedy, man. They, they, they out here. They greedy, man. They greedy. Where is it at, Malachi? I think it's Malachi 3 and 11 or Micah 3 and 11. It's, it's Micah. It's a lock here. Micah 3 and 10. Let's go 9. Micah 3 and 9. Hear this, I pray you. Ye heads of the house of Jacob and princes of the house of Israel that abhor judgment and pervert all equity. They build up Zion with blood and Jerusalem with inequity. The heads thereof judge for reward and the priests thereof teach for hire and the prophets thereof divine for money. Yet will they lean upon the Lord and say is not the Lord among us. None evil shall come upon us. Yeah, this is what they be doing, man. When they get in these spots, man, when they get in them spots, they swear and they swear that they think they good money. They think they good. I got here. I got, I'm, I'm, I'm legal. I got this, the, 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 the Bible. I got the, the, this Christian doctrine and I'm hustling the people. Yeah, look, look, look. Go back up to one. And I said, here, I pray you, O heads of Jacob, and ye princes of the house of Israel, is it not for you to know judgment, who hate the good and love evil, who pluck off their skin from off them and their flesh from off their bones? That go back to the dry bones. No flesh putting the flesh to understand it back on the dry bones. These heads here. They doing the opposite. They trying to take the understanding of the scriptures off of you. They trying to strip you. They trying to have, what, what's that one right here? Um, they try to keep you and remain in the congregation of the dead. Let's get that. Thinking about them bones. Where is it at? Proverbs, right? Proverbs 21 and 16. This ain't going to be long, man. I just seen this, man. Just seen, I'm like, man, because I did a, a couple of, Lessons in the past on this guy. So I was like, it's good to see the outcome. And I remember when he when he was doing his thing before all this came out. I was like, yeah, I did a lesson saying, I, you know, you're going to get it sooner or later. And there it is. Proverbs 21 and 16. 
the man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. Yeah, man. The congregation of the dead. That's them bones going back to them bones like I was saying in Ezekiel 37. So the these dudes are stripping the bones, stripping them off it, stripping, stripping the understanding off you. Look, 11. Nah, Ezekiel 37 and 9. Then said he unto me, prophesy unto the wind, prophesy, son of man, and say to the wind, thus saith the Lord power, come from the four winds, O breath, and breathe upon these slain that they may live. So I prophesied as he commanded me, and the breath came into them, and they lived and stood up upon their feet, an exceeding great army. Then he said unto me, Son of man, these bones, remember going back to them bones we was reading about in, Mic in Micah, right? These bones are the whole house of Israel. Behold, they say our bones are dry and our hope is lost. We are cut off for our parts. Yeah. Therefore prophesy and say unto them, thus saith the Lord power, behold, O my people, I will open your graves and cause you to come up out of your graves and bring you into the land of Israel. This is, this is, and they going against that. They just the opposite. They just the opposite. They doing just the opposite. These prophets out here, dudes like him, they doing the opposite, right? Micah 3 and 3. Who also eat the flesh of my people and fillet their skin from off them and they break their bones and chop them in pieces as for a pot and as for flesh within the cauldron yeah they work they going against they working against we out here bringing out the truth they working so hard against us and why they working so hard against us they giving you all the information they giving you is not helping it's keeping you in that same state watch lamentations lamentations Salakia. Yeah, I'm just rolling now. Salakia, where is that? Where is that? Slow down, slow down. There you go. 2 and 14. Lamentation 2. Matter of fact, I'm not even rolling. The spirit rolling. <laughs> the spirit dealing right now. Lamentation 2 and 14. Thy prophets have seen vain and foolish things for thee. And they have not discovered thine inequity to turn away the captivity, but have seen for thee false burdens and causes of banishment. Yeah, they working against it. They, they striving against the truth. They striving against the men that's trying to help put the understanding, put that, help, help, uh, put that flesh, that knowledge, that skin back on the nation of Israel. They working against them. With they little shenanigans and um the 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 first the the pastor got got his first man and all that they just working totally against women um, preachers they working against the truth for the scriptures but it's all it's 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 there it, it's there it's it's there let me see. See, yeah, look, Jeremiah 5 and 4. Therefore, I say, surely these are poor, they are foolish, for they know not the way of the Lord, nor the judgment of their power. I will get me unto the great men and will speak unto them, for they have known the way of the Lord and the judgment of their power. But these have altogether broken the yoke and burst the bonds. Yeah, they going against the truth. But then you go down here, nine, shall I not visit for these things, saith the Lord, and shall not my soul be avenged on such a nation as this? Yeah. Look, 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 there's one more in here I want to get. There's one more in here, then I'll close out. Let's go. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't want to make it too long. Here it is, some foolish people. Let's go down to 23. But this people, Jeremiah 5 and 23, but this people have a revolting and a rebellious heart. They are revolted and gone. Neither say they in their heart, let us now fear the Lord. No fear the Lord when you're doing this. You in the Lord's house calling yourself a man of the Lord and you you robbing um, robbing people, doing all kind of shenanigans, shaking people down so you could look fly. Come on, man. It was all about what he wanted, man. Supposing that um, gain is godly, man. Um, neither say they in their heart, let us now fear the Lord our power. And what, what's the other one? The love of money is the root of all evil. Not money, the love of money. Covenant after money. Being covetous, man. Neither say they in their heart, let us now fear the Lord our power that giveth rain, both the former and the latter in his season. He reserveth unto us the appointed weeks of the harvest. Your inequities have turned away these things. Your sins have up withholding good things from you. For among, this the, this the part I want right here. For among my people are found wicked men. They lay wait as, the, as he that set of snares, they set a trap. They catch men. Yeah. As a cage is full of birds, so are their houses full of deceit. So are their houses full of deceit. Therefore, they are become great and waxing rich. Yeah, this is it, man. They are waxing fat. They shine. Yea, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. Yeah, they wicked. You more wicked than Esau when you get the scriptures and you are uh, manipulating it to, to, to um, live a lavishing lifestyle. Meanwhile, you ain't even telling the truth with the scriptures. You lying on top of lying. You lying with what you telling them and you lying them to, to, to prosper, to deceive them, to, to con them out of money. They judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless, yet they prosper and the right of the needy do they not judge. Shall not, look, shall not I visit for these things, saith the Lord, shall not my soul be avenged on such a nation as this? <laughs> yeah, the Lord visited him, man. It's the Lord visiting him. Look, that, that's the perfect photo right there. We're going to leave it right there. Bling Bishop. Bling Bishop going to jail for nine years. Uh, Bling Bishop. You go from here, here, fly man, fly man, chilling. Chilling, got your swag, got your swag to now. Here, boom. You gonna join Brother Polite. <laughs> so with that one, we gonna close out. All praises, honor, glory to Yahweh. By Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to the elders, to the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike to a speckled bird. Tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, and myself remain spiritual out there. This is case closed. I opened up the case on this dude. I brought it to the congregation. He wasn't listening. I know he wouldn't listen. He probably didn't hear the last, but you know you was going off. We opened up the case. Now the case is closed. And it's going to be a lot more cases like this Are you foot you fake false pastors out there. We warning you. The warning is going out. We warning y'all. Shalom.